What do you see? Tell me what you see. They're pairs. Everything is in a pair. Right? The first pair. Right? They're all in pairs. Right? So one, two, three, four, five. Six pairs. Six groups of people. Six groups of people. Now we want to know, like you, what are they doing? What do they do? So we want to know their job. What job do they do? What's their job? Now what's their job? Okay, so the first thing you do, you look at the look at the first pair, right? What's their what does she do?
stethoscope. Now, I'm not sure if that's stetho scope or stetho. Is it stetho or stetho? How do you spell stethoscope? Stethoscope. How do you spell it? I think it's A. It might even be A. A stethoscope. And that's definitely the S T E and Steph. How is it spelled? S T S T E D. Right, what goes in there? What goes in there? Steph O scope. Stethoscope. Because we say stetha, it sounds like A, but it's O, stethoscope. Because it's in here. This book is good, isn't it? It's a noun. A, a noun, alright? Is it countable or uncountable? I think it's countable now. It's a countable noun, right? Because we can have stethoscopes. Stethoscopes becomes a countable noun. A stethoscope, two stethoscopes make it into a plural. So it's a countable noun. But in a good book, it would tell you. Alright, it would tell you if she's wearing a stethoscope, C. Countable. It will put the letter C in the dictionary. Or in your... Let's have a look in your book. Yes. Right, let's have a look in your book. It should be good, this book, right? Let's go. Check her. Check her. Check her. Right, somewhere in there. Yes. S T E. Stethoscope. Should tell us countable or uncountable. So you've got you've got electronic gadgets that can help you, but sometimes they won't give you full inf information right here. Yeah. It just says stethoscope. All right. Does it tell you it's a noun? Does it say noun? Yes. Yeah? Because yeah. it's entire. No good to me. Right. No good to me. But usually if it's a noun, it's written as uh, N. Right? It's countable. If it's a noun, so it'll be an N. Countable now. Alright, so we know what she's doing. What does she do? She's a doctor. Works in a hospital. Yeah. She's a doctor in a hospital. She's a doctor in a hospital. She's a doctor, she's wearing a test stethoscope. Now, second picture, what is the doctor doing? What is she doing? Yeah, but how do we how do you explain that to somebody? How do you explain that? What's she doing? She's a doctor. She's not teaching. She is not teaching. She is not teaching. She is. What is she doing? 
She's studying. Yes. She's learning. Yes. Self study. She's yes. learning. What is she learning? In the daytime, she's a doctor. Free time, she's not working. Free time. Free time. She studies. She studies. Right. French language. Perhaps you say she studies the French language, maybe better, right? She studies the French language. She's She's learning, she's learning French. Right, so she studies, she's learning. It's two things that you can say. So she's learning French. She's studying the French language. So she's not working, free time. For a nurse or a doctor, she is off. She's not working, she's off. She's not working, she's not on duty. If she's a nurse, she works, she's on duty. Right, so she's on duty, she's a doctor. On duty, as a doctor. So she's on duty. <coughs> Her free time, she's off duty, on duty, off duty. Some people go to work, it's not duty, they just go to work. Right? So you work, you don't work. You're at work, you're relaxing, at, at, on free time, you're not working. 